everyone here's a question on hcf the question is find the hcf of 24 and 36 now hcf stands for highest common factor now there are many ways like a long division method prime factors method listing factors method so here i'm going to explain you how to do using a prime factorization method now for prime factorization method we have to do a prime factorization of both the numbers separately so, okay so we're going to draw lines like this and here I'm going to draw a horizontal line, vertical line this way. Now I'm going to take number separately. Okay, first I'm going to do a 24 and the second I'm going to do for 36. Now like I mentioned before, it is a prime factorization method. We have to take only prime numbers. Fine. You should not take any other number. So you have to divide the 24 with the prime number. So you can you have to check from 2 because 2 is the smallest prime number. Keep on checking with the 2 like a 2 then 3 then 5 then 7. We have to check with which all number you can divide it. Now 24 is an even number so obviously it can be divisible by 2. So I'm going to divide with the 2. Now 2 is a prime number. Okay. So 2 12 is 24. Yep. Then if you don't know 2 12 is 24 you can divide 24 and 2 separately. You can divide here 24 and 2 and you can in case you don't know you can divide and check the answer then again 12 so 12 goes in two table so 2 6 is a 12 now again i'm going to take 2 2 3 is a 6 now we got 3 so th 3 doesn't go in two table right so 3 1 is a 3 now here 2 and 3 are prime numbers you should not i cannot take here 4 or 6 because 4 and 6 are not prime number the method which we're using is a prime factorization method now same thing we're going to do it for 36 now 36 goes in two table right so two ones are two one is a remainder we'll get 16 so two eights are 16 so this is a short way i'll do it in case you didn't understand how i'm doing it you can divide 36 by two two ones are two remainder is one drop the six then two eights are 16 like that okay i have done in short way again we got uh, 18 here it goes in two tables so two nines are 18. now nine doesn't come in two tables so next prime number is three so nine goes in three tables so three threes are nine and three is again a prime number so three ones are three that's it now once we have done this step what i gonna do i gonna write down once again so 24 is equal to write down all the factors what you got the prime factors so it's a 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 yeah similarly for 36 also write down all these prime factors here it is 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 now once we have done this is really important we have to find out the common prime factor like see 2 is present in this both yeah so this i got one pair here i got another two which is like present in both i got one three which is present in both so the for this two i got this two for this one i got this for this two i don't have any other two so i cannot make a pair here for this two similarly for this three also i don't have any other three in for the 24 for this number so these two numbers we cannot pair up so we are we are taking a common prime factor we are making a common of this all now once we have got the pair like this you have to just multiply so hcf of 24 and 36 will be so this numbers from this pair you take one two okay and from this pair you take one two and from this pair you take one three that's it so multiply them two twos are four four twos are twelve so twelve is the answer so 12 is the highest common factor i hope this question is clear so i'm going to make a, another video of uh, same this question find the hcf of 24 and 36 using a division method now division method is little different than this method now if whichever method is easier for you can follow that i hope this method is much easier mostly people follow this method now in case you have any other question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching